throw away. My wife, L, and I have been married for a year now. Back in the day, L worked as a sports model. Her job required her to meet a very rigid beauty standard and look a certain way. She was always on a strict diet and was severely underweight. Since then, she's gained a healthy amount of weight and muscle and is much happier. My brother, Chris, is wealthy, like extremely wealthy. He's done well for himself and seems happy about where he is in life. He's just got out of a nasty divorce with his ex-wife and has asked to stay with me for a few weeks as he moves into his new place. Chris, to put it simply, has a type. He believes that every woman should subscribe to his type. Any woman who doesn't fit his preference is automatically ugly and unlovable. He wants all women to conform to his standards. Hell or high water. Two days ago, Chris found some of Elle's old magazine covers and commented on how beautiful she was back then. It's a harmless comment, sure, but he kept bringing up how much she's let herself go. I mean, kept bringing it up. Elle goes for a run every evening, and as she was heading out the door, Chris told her to run fast enough to lose all the flabby bits. She rolled her eyes and laughed it off, but I told him to shut up. The next day, when Elle went to the gym, he told her to make sure to return to her old figure. Again, I told him to shut up and stop fixating on my wife's body. Despite all his comments, Elle is a little unfazed by all of it. She says that she's used to it. By the end of the day, I was completely exhausted from listening to him. I was at my end, but Elle again brushed him off with a smile and with a laugh. When Elle served him food, he made a joke about paying for her tummy tuck so that I can marry the right version of Elle, the right version is the skinnier version of her. That comment set me off. I told him that his wife married the wrong version of him and to pack his shit and leave my house. He did not take kindly to this and complained about how insensitive I was to his situation and how I made a low blow. He eventually left, but Elle tells me that I could have kicked him out without the comment. Ata? NTA. If he is going to be insensitive to other people, then he should expect to receive insensitive comments. With his views and unsolicited advice, I don't think Chris is anyone's type. Maybe if he treated women differently, he may still be married. Yes. That is such an important point for so many situations. People not liking it and getting angry when getting treated as they treat others. Making comments, then say it's not respectful when they get the exact same comment back. Your brother made multiple unwelcome, sexualized comments about your wife's appearance. No matter if she was your wife or not, your brother was way out of line. You asked him multiple times to stop, he refused. When he wouldn't stop, you pointed out that his behavior now is likely linked to his divorce. I think that's an entirely fair assumption to make. If he'd say this mess to your wife in front of you, I can only imagine what he said to his ex-wife in the privacy of their home. Elle is too concerned with your brother's feelings. He is unworthy of anyone's sympathy in this situation. The fact that your wife is accustomed to these comments just speaks to the sad state of our society, that she normalizes his creepy comments and laughs off harassment in her own home by a member of her husband's family. Keep standing up to creeps who say unwelcome comments to and about women. NTA. Edit. Thank you internet strangers for the awards. This. Perfectly said. NTA. Your brother is proof that money doesn't buy class, and if this is how he treats women I suspect this will be one of many divorces in his future. I'm curious how an extremely wealthy person needs to stay in his brother's house. It's one thing to crash for a night or a weekend, but a few weeks as a hotel or ebb for someone with money. Maybe we have differing views on extreme wealth but for me, bare minimum would require someone to not have to ask to stay with someone. Your wife's responses are possibly a coping mechanism from many years of prejudice and sexual discrimination. Regardless, you have a right and responsibility as a spouse to be upset and protect your wife from harm, which you did. Your brother appears to have very little awareness of his own behaviors, which I imagine contributed to his divorce in the first place. He will either keep up this behavior until he has no relationships at all or eventually fix himself. Either way, you are not obligated to be around that type of mess to find out. Yes, there's no way she wasn't hurt by this, but we've been conditioned to smile our way through judgments about our bodies. NTA. 
Not sure why you're in doubt on that point, honestly. His situation has nothing to do with asterisk why oh you are asterisk wife. There's no reason for him to be picking on her or commenting on her body at all. Sure, you didn't need to explain yourself when telling him to leave, but if he can't take unsolicited criticism, he shouldn't be engaging in it himself. Probably because his wife is a pushover slash extremely anti-conflict and might have felt undeserving of him sticking up for her. My brother and his GF were living with me and my husband for like 6 months. My brother was great, but his GF said some rude s asterisk 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 and was overall being disrespectful, so my husband told her off. I was upset at first because I didn't want to rock the boat, but he saw how upset it was making me and put his foot down. It took me a couple days to get over it and not be annoyed with my husband for it just due to my own sensibilities and I get the feeling that might be what's happening with Op as well. Or his brother told family and they took his brother's side. Stupid is so. Either way I'm sure this will blow over for Op soon. I thought you were definitely going to be tar from the title. I was wrong. NTA. Okay, it was a low blow about his divorce, but given the revolting nature of his comments and the fact that he explicitly insulted your wife while you are putting a roof over his head makes it understandable. You are only human. You were far more polite than I would have been. If he's wealthy he didn't need to stay with Op because he had nowhere else to go. It was for the support of his family. Who he insults. What was Op getting out of having his gross toxic a asterisk asterisk in his house? NTA and if I had an award I would give it to you. Good for you for standing up to your jerk of a bro. Why is he obsessed with your wife's body? What a creep. And as far as I'm concerned, that wasn't a low blow. That was a reality check. It's any wonder he's divorced. He sounds completely insufferable. NTA. You did right in throwing his ungrateful and misogynistic asterisk asterisk out of your house. So NTA. You have asked him several times to keep his comments and sexism basically to himself. His opinion was not asked at all, and even then what he said is uncalled for. He should realize that everyone has their own standards and views on beauty, and don't comment on everyone who passes them. He may have his opinion. He needs to learn not to share when not asked for. NTA. Your brother's comments are creepy, insulting and inappropriate, all in one go. He's lusting over his brother's wife younger pictures, and demanding she work on going back to the way she was. It's his brother's wife. Why should he care if she's attractive to him or not? NTA, you should have kicked him out sooner. Yeah if it were me, we'd have had a come to Jesus. Talk after the first comments. Dude clearly kept bringing it up how she'd let herself go. Clearly the shut ups weren't cutting it. I get that L seemed to be brushing it off, but I wouldn't have waited for my spouse to act bothered by it. This is an appropriate and offense regardless. Obviously good that op finally did something other than say shut up. NTA your brother is tough for his rude comments to your wife. Not only is he family, but he was a guest in your home, and he was acting extremely rude. I wonder if that was what caused the divorce. And if he's so wealthy, then he can get his own hotel room somewhere. NTA your brother was being an insensitive ass. You were being a good husband and standing up for your wife. It is true you cold sent him packing without a low blow. But as we always say here, he dish it out, but can't take it. You're a good husband. And that's probably why you're not divorced. You mean the appropriate way to thank someone for letting you stay there isn't to make rude comments about their spouse's body? Damn dude why do you have to be so sensitive? NTA for sure. NTA I think your comment wasn't anywhere near as rude as his especially after the two of you generously opened your home up to him. I can't believe his audacity glad you had the sense to not tolerate your wife being disrespected. As it seems, so many men will let it slide when it comes to family. NTA you should have kicked him out sooner and your wife doesn't need to accept misogynistic comments. Your wife still exercises daily. I'm sure she hasn't let herself go. And even if she had. Jeez your brother is insufferable. How simple minded do you have to be to not understand people have different preferences and aren't all attracted to what he's attracted to. Brother sounds like the type to think any woman who isn't bone thin skinny is overweight clearly ignoring the fact that she put on muscle which is healthy. NTA. 
he needs knocked down a notch or two, your comment was totally acceptable after the things he said. NTA he wanted to play, you tried to be gentle, and he didn't respect the boundary you presented. Bet this is one of the major reasons he is divorced. You are absolutely right about that. He will never learn. If people keep laughing his behavior off, it is not okay. NTA. He had the audacity to complain that you were being insensitive towards him. NTA. He wouldn't let it go. L showed incredible restraint and grace with dealing with a boorish asshole. If Chris is so fabulous and wealthy, then he can find another place to live and surround himself with women that are up to his standards. Definitely. I wouldn't have been able to hold out telling him where to f asterisk 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 off to Nilly as long as she did. If this is how this dude treats his sill, then fucking imagine how he treated his own wife. No wonder the woman abandoned ship. NTA. Ely shouldn't have had to got used to his insults. He deserved the comment back and to get kicked out. Was all set to say YTA. But hell no. NTA. Sounds like your brother is a massive dick. Good for you for calling him out on it. And thank you for standing up for your wife. NTA. I doubt you could have addressed this earlier, rather than letting it build. He did tell the brother to stop repeatedly. I've read the same story before point can't they write new stuff? NTA. But almost a YTA for not kicking him out sooner. Your brother is disgusting. I think I read this story before. Deja vu? Glad I'm not the only one. I'm sure I've read this exact thing before. Edit, Mr. Word. I swear I've read this exact story before. Same. I just commented on this. Somehow the wife laughing off incredibly insulting comments as she walks out the door seemed really out of place then and now. NTA. Good for you for defending your wife and taking a stand against your brother's misogyny. You had asked him multiple times to stop, and he kept going. Not only was he out of line to keep on after you asked him to stop, it was entirely inappropriate for him to be making comments like this about someone else's wife. Honestly, if he went on like this at home, I can see why he is now divorced. He shouldn't even harass his own wife like this. In short, your brother needs to learn that his mouth is better used for eating instead of spouting off his opinions, which absolutely no one else cares about. NTA, and your brother is a big asshole. NTA and L sounds lovely. I wouldn't apologize to him, but I might to her actually. Admit that you lost your cool, but tell her you love and appreciate her and it just tipped you over that he was being disrespectful to her. I feel like this might mean a lot to her. When you do talk to your brother, I think you should calmly explain to him that disrespecting your wife is not okay ever and won't be tolerated or excused as a joke. NTA, but you came close by subjecting your wife to that crap for so long emo. His s asterisk 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 should been packed on that second comment.